Hey everybody, it's Mr. D bringing you another word family challenge. This week we've got three word families. We've got sp, ch, and and together we're going to find more words involving those. What the? Did somebody turn me into a strange looking kitty? This is Mr. Kitty. Okay, that's it. We're going to the next page. Woohoo, hooray. It's our very first challenge where we've, where we've had three word families to study. So we're going to use green for sp, red for ch, and blue for th. Now, I notice down here you're going to see all three of those letter combinations in our words. Sometimes at the beginning, sometimes at the end. But don't worry, we're going to study them together. So, since there's so many of the words, you guessed it. I'm going to... <clears throat> I'm going to... Whoopsie. Add those combinations. I'm just going to say them. Sp. 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 That gets my brain ready. Next one is CH. Say ch. 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 Sounds like I'm doing ch. Ch. Cha. Cha. Next, I've got TH. Good job, team. Now, let's go down to the words. Instead of eight words, we've got 12 today. So we've got our work cut out for us. I notice that this word starts with sp. So what I'm going to do is I'm just going to notice the word beginnings or the word endings. And I'm just going to underline them so my brain has a connection and is ready to start sounding words out. Do you see how I'm just sort of connecting it? Now, this is something you might not be able to do at home, but since we're on video with Mr. D, we can kind of watch him and do it with him, which is pretty cool. Pretty cool. All right, we've got all the colors matched. Whoopsie. Now, let's do some sounding out work. We'll start here with this word. Ready? Three, two, one. Sp in. Put it together. Spin. Oh, like you spin around on the playground. So now I'm going to take that word and I'm going to put it here in the sp column. Ready? Sp in. Good job, team. Whoopsie. Let's go ahead and cross it out. And let's go across to the next word. I see it's red. For ch. Ready? Ch. Up. Chop. Kind of like you chop vegetables. So I take it and I'm going to put it in my chip section. Chip up. Good job. Cross it out. Now I noticed something in this next word. I noticed that the letter combination is at the end. And I also noticed this double E. I've never seen that before. Two E's together usually makes an E sound. So watch me sound this out. T E T. Put it together. Teeth. Hey, that's like our teeth that we have in our mouth. So this is going to be a little tricky to fit, but I'm going to put it into my th section. T -e -th. Teeth. Good job, team. Cross it out. Okay, let's go across to our next word. Ready? I see a C-H. It's like ch -ip. chip. Hey, like a chip that you eat. Let's put it into our ch section. Ch -ip. Good job, team. Wow, we did all that in such a short time. Let's keep going. I'm going to keep using red, and we're going to go down to this word. Ready? Three, two, one. Ch. In. Put it together. Chin. Hey, like my chin. So I put my put my word into my ch section. Ch. In. Good job, team. Let's cross it out, and we'll go across to the next one. Ready? I see green. Three, two, one. Sp. Ill. Put it together. Spill. Oh, like sometimes we spill our milk. So I'm going to put it into my sp section. Ready? Sp. Ill. Good job, team. Cross it out. Next word we've got. Let's 
Let's see, it's red for ch. Three, two, one. Ch. At. Chat. Oh, kind of, uh, tad is like another word for talking. Ch. At. Good job, team. And I noticed something. Look. All of the spots for ch are filled. So no more of these words are going to be are going to be ch words. Our next word I see has a sp. Ready? Three, two, one. Sp. It. Put it together. Spit. Ooh, gross. That's not something that's very nice to do. Sp. It. Spit. And cross it out. Okay, I see one, two, three, four more words. Let's try them out. I see blue for this one, and look, it's at the end. Three, two, one. Math. Math. Hey, that's one of our subjects in school. So I take it, put it into my section. Math. Jump team, cross it out. Next word's also blue. Ooh, I see one, two, three blue on this, uh, in this row. Ready? Three, two, one. P path. Path. Ooh. Like a path in the forest. It's like a trail. P path. Path. Cross it out. Good job, team. Next word. I see a SP. Sp. Three, two, one. Sp. At. Spot. Now, a spot can be a couple things. It could be like a spot, a little piece of color on a dog or a cat. It could be a spot on your uh, clothes because you spilled something. Or it could even be like a parking spot, sort of like a place. So some words have more than one meaning. That's what's so cool about them. So I'm going to take it and I'm going to put it up here. Ready? Three, two, one. Sp at. Good job, team. Last word. Now this is funny because this word is actually a, a sight word. That. That. And this word is a word that you might want to just know with your eyes. And I noticed that the TH is actually at the beginning of the word here. I'm going to take it and look. It's kind of the opposite of the other words. Do you see? These words start up here. This word, the TH, is at the beginning. That's kind of cool. I'm noticing a lot of things about words, which is helping my brain to get super smart. Okay, everybody. Now that we've studied all of these words, we're going to use our yellow pencil, and we're going to say all the words we've learned. We'll start up here. The sp section. Three, two, one. Spin. Spill. Spit. Ew. Spot. Good job. There's our sp. Now let's move to our ch section. Three, two, one. Chop. Chip. Chin. Chat. Good job. There's our ch. Ch. And last is our th. It's almost like you're sticking your tongue out. Ready? Our first word, three, two, one. Teeth, math, path, that. Very cool, team. We beat all three of these word family challenges. Okay, team. So if you paid attention, listened, tried your best today, you studied three word families. Sp, ch, and and if you did that, guess what? You made your brain happy. And you guessed it. You also made Mr. D happy. And look, there's my beard and my crazy hair. And let's see, today my body's going to be a horse. And there's my horsey legs. Here's the thing. Draw a horse. There's my horsey legs. <laughs> and here's my horsey tail. Does that actually look like a horse? Not really, Mr. T. But that's okay, right? I'm just having fun. So, today we studied three word families. Sp, ch, and th. And together, we earned another thumbs up star from Mr. D. Good job, everybody. I'll see you soon. Bye.